So we want to we want to click on this part. And apparently I fried the fridge. Repair failed. You just failed to repair the object. The object remains destroyed. But stay calm, you have some attempts left. So try to repair the fridge again. Okay? Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to take a look at a new game coming out to Steam called Handyman Corporation. Now this is the prologue. It's free to pick up for everyone on Steam right now. It came out on December 16th. So let's take a look at it. I have played it a little bit just to get used to the, to the controls and how they work. So let's hit new game. And here we are. Warm welcome. Hello. Welcome to Handyman Corporation. Here you will learn to become the best handyman in town. In this tutorial, you will learn how to develop your skills and become the best handyman. This is basically just uh, telling you what to, what to expect. Typical movement stuff. Wife, common sense is like deodorant. The people who need it most never seem to use it. That's funny. So this, I guess, is our our wife, and um, this is our house where we live. Uh, I'm not sure what my wife does for a living, dressed like that, but um, okay. Hopefully she's making some money for us also doing something. All right, let's get on with it. We've got, um, looks like we've got $100 in the bank. We have zero contracts, we have a date and a time up there, and we have a clock. So we are supposed to go to the laptop and select contracts. Contract browser, this is contract browser. Uh, let's see, client information, requirements, preferences, and budget. One thing this game does different, uh, you get you get some uh, house flipper vibes or some electrician simulator vibes in this game. Uh, basically, we do mini games for each task, uh, but one of the, a couple of differences is you do have a budget that you can go over, and we have options to repair things. Um, if you don't repair it, you can destroy it, and then you have another option to fix the destroyed part. So that's kind of where this game differs a little bit. We have client satis satisfaction as well. All right, so let's go into. Oh, let's see, this is our first job. And we need to fix or replace the fridge, replace the carpet, replace the chairs, paint kitchen, paint kitchen, full kitchen. And then they also have preferences. They like the Bios brand and they want pink paint. So it looks like this job is going to pay us $2,100. So let's take the job. Congratulations, you accepted the contract. Okay. Uh, so now it's time to repair the fridge. And we'll start there. I'm not going to go through this whole... Uh, I'm kind of just giving the gist of this time constraints. Uh, you do need to complete it in a certain amount of time. Uh, we get bonuses if we complete the job faster. We get a bonus. We get a penalty if it's too slow. All right, so our first task, you see our task over there, and you can hit the tab key to bring your task back. We're supposed to uh, work in the kitchen first. So let's go. Um, this house is set up a little odd but you can see that highlighted over there that's our first task is to fix the refrigerator right here so what we need to do first uh, the Q key uh, gives us a wiki and paint roller perks inventory and a toolbox we do have a perk six system I don't think that is that's not in yeah this isn't here yet so uh, we want to look at the wiki and what we're going to do is we're going to repair the fridge, a damaged fridge. So this tells us what we need on every job. So we need a screwdriver and we need screws. And then we can watch a little uh, little video that tells us what we need to do. So basically we're just plugging the wires in. If we do that correctly, we'll get, uh, we'll get paid for the job. We can finish it. All right, so we need to buy a screwdriver and screws first. Many games. Um, this is talking about parts we need, tools we need. I just talked about that and the wiki. Okay. Okay. It wants me to do this all in order. Okay. We're gonna hold Q. We're gonna go to the wiki. Okay. That's what we just looked at. I was kind of jumping ahead of the tutorial. Okay. So um, damage fridge. Yes. Memorize the tools and close the menu. Okay. Now we get to hit F. That's our phone. We order tools from our phone. 
So we need a screwdriver. We're going to add that to cart. And we're going to scroll down here to screws. There we go. Now we have to hit checkout. First tool purchase. And we're going to get out of there. Now then, if you see the top right, we have to wait for the truck to deliver our tools. So let's go over here to the front door. And there's our box of tools right there. There we go. Now we're carrying our tools. Now we have to set the toolbox next. I'm going to shut this door. We're going to set the toolbox next to our work area. So hold Q down, go to toolbox, and it'll turn green where we can set it. Right there. Now then, we're going to attempt to fix this damaged refrigerator. Attempt to repair it. So again, this is, we're going to start a mini game. It gives you another chance to watch the wiki video if you didn't already watch it, which we did. So we want to we want to click on this part. And apparently, I fried the fridge. Repair failed. You just failed to repair the object. The object remains destroyed. But stay calm. You have some attempts left. So try to repair the fridge again. Okay. So now the fridge is destroyed. At first it was just damaged, now it's destroyed. So we need to go back to our circular menu and go to Wiki and click on Destroyed Fridge. Okay, so these are the parts we need for a destroyed fridge. We need screws, eight screws, condenser, screwdriver, wire cutter, and domino. Okay, that's all the tools that we need. And then again, we can watch the little video on how to repair it. But I'm going to take you through this so we don't have to sit here and watch this. All right. So what all I have to do now is buy wire cutter, condenser, screws, and domino. So let's go back to our phone, back to tools, and we need a domino. And we need, uh, we bought 15 screws. And we need to buy a condenser. And we need a wire cutter right here. All right. So it's $62. We're going to check out. Should give us everything that we need. Let's get out of that. Get out of our phone. And then we have to go back and pick up the tools that just got delivered. Big box. That was a big box of tools. Oh, well, that condenser is pretty big. I think that's what the problem is. All right. So let's get back to our refrigerator. And... We should be able to fix, attempt to repair the destroyed refrigerator. So now we have different mini games. Again, it gives you a chance to go to the wiki and watch the video if you forgot what you're supposed to do. So I'm going to cut that wire. And I'm going to cut that wire. And now we're going to unscrew the condenser. Pretty straightforward. It tells you which direction we need to be going. And you see there's a timer up at the top right there. I think we have a, an hour to complete this job, I think. And maybe that's just because it's a tutorial. Seems like a long time that gives us to complete this job. But it also said your parts take longer if um, longer than the tu tutorial. Normally it takes longer for your parts to get delivered. All right, here's the condenser. We're going to place that. There we go. And now we're going to screw it back on. All right, we got that done. Now let's take our domino. And we need to place it. Oh, it placed it for us. We just have to plug these in. There we go. And now we got to screw those dominoes in. There we go. Repair success. Great. The fridge is now in good condition. The client will be moderately satisfied. To make them extremely happy, a perfect fridge is recommended, which requires you to buy a new one from the shop. I'm not going to do that. That would get into our budget situation. That we could get to, and I'm sure that'll really pan itself out in the regular game. 
Uh, preferences can be found in the task list. They are important details from clients. It would greatly increase the client satisfaction. And painting. The customer wants you to repaint his kitchen room walls. Okay. I think that's what we, we are going to do next, I believe. All right. So we can pick our toolbox up, get it out of the way. Now, we got to go back to the laptop and interact with it. And select shop. Look at the shop browser here. You can buy items for your customers. Once you buy an item for it, wait for it to be delivered. Okay, we talked about that. So we need to go to paint. And I know the customer wanted pink paint because it told us that in the beginning. There we go. Now I have to wait for delivery. And there's our newly bought paint bucket. Wall painting. Uh, you first need to have a paint bucket placed near your work area. Okay. So we hold this, and I think we go to inventory. Yes. We need to place the paint bucket down, like so. And now we hit Q again and get our paint roller out. Oh, I'm sorry. I got to purchase a paint roller. I thought I already had a paint roller. I have not. I did not. There we go. Add to cart. It's $15. So you see the money we're spending. It's counting down from that $2,100 that we got up front for the contract. All right, now we should be good to go. There we go. Paint roller added to your inventory. Now let's shut the door, hit Q, go to paint roller, and we are ready to start painting now. So we just highlight area on the wall, and then we dip our paint roller in the bucket. Pretty straightforward process. There we go. Awesome. You're now ready to complete the remaining requirements on your own. All right. There we go. Fill my roller back up. This is how we change to go to the next wall. Oh, my roller's empty. There we go. I actually like the I like the mini game. It's pretty fun. All right, so this tells you how many walls you've done, or how many sections of that wall. When this is com or all the way over, that wall is complete. So you know, like that, that wall is complete. Now we're gonna go just go to the next wall. Click on it. Fill our roller up. It's also telling us how much paint is left in our bucket. All right, let's see. This place is looking pink. And we have one more wall left. Nice, that's done. Kitchen is painted. All right, cool. Now let's pick up, let's put a roller away. Let's pick this up. And put an in inventory. We've got some extra pink paint left over. All right, uh, let's see. We need. Let's hit our tab. Uh, the next one is we got to fix the microwave, replace the trash can. All right, let's replace this trash can. You can sell it, and let's see. We have to buy one from the shop. And I believe it's in kitchen. Yeah, trash can. Buy a trash can for $35. And then once again, we have to go... We have to go get it from the uh, delivery. This one's a little slower. See, it's taking... Uh, we beat it here. 10 seconds, 7 seconds. There's a trash can. There we go. Perfect condition. This is the condition here. Perfect. Alright, that's off the list. Now we need to, to uh, fix or replace the microwave. Alright, let's see what we need. So before I look at it, I'm going to go... I'm going to go to my wiki. And... Oops. There we go. If I want to fix a microwave... Damaged. What tools do I need to brush? Screws. Screwdriver and wire cutter. We still have uses left in these. 
I need, and I don't know if I have enough screws or not. And I need a brush. A toolbox. We need to put our toolbox back down. And open toolbox. A screwdriver has eight uses left. Uh, I have 11 screws. Wire cutter has 14 uses left. And there's my paint roller. So all I need to buy now is a brush from the store. Tools, brush, check out. And once again, I have to go pick it up from delivery. All right, now hopefully we can repair this microwave. Let's go back to our wiki. And let's go to microwave damaged. You can watch the video. It tells, you what, it tells us what we need to do to repair this thing. All right, I'm not going to watch all of it. But I just want to show you guys that's what you do. So attempt to repair. All right, we just unscrew this part. There we go. Now we have to unplug those, or basically cut the wires. There we go. Now we got to take our brush, and we got to clean this thing. And you see there's a percentage up there on cleaning it. Now I'm going to rotate it with my right mouse button. There's really no gimmies on this job. Which I'm okay with that. All right, we're at 93%, almost there. Oh, here we go. There's there's some more dirt there. 100%, cool. Now, we have to click on the antenna repeatedly to fix it. Kind of an odd mini game there, but all right, now we have to plug it back in. There we go. And screw the cover back on. All right, so we should, uh, the object became perfect. So we should get credit for that, for just fixing that, and we saved a lot of money there. All right, let's pick our toolbox up, and then the next thing we have to do is fix or replace the carpet. All right, let's see here. Carpet destroyed. So if the carpet is destroyed, let's go to the wiki. What do we need to fix destroyed carpet? We need a needle and we need an iron. And again, we can watch the video here. Seems pretty straightforward. Then we iron it. Okay. We need to buy an needle, a needle and an iron. So hit F for a phone. And we're going to go to tools again. And there's the needle and there's the iron. There we go. Now we have to wait for our parts to be delivered. There we go. And let's go ahead and start working on this carpet. Attempt to repair. Oh, sorry, I need to place my toolbox down. I always forget that. There we go. Toolbox has to be right there, close. All right, so we start up here. Basically, we're going across. Like so, pretty simple. And then we're going to just iron it out. There we go. And then and then we have to uh, brush it where we are ironing. All 
There we go. All right, so we fixed the carpet. Now the last thing we need to do, let's pick up our toolbox. The last thing we need to do is to replace these chairs. And let's see, I'm not sure if there's anything in the wiki. No, I think basically we're just buying new chairs. So we can sell these first. They're destroyed, there's no repair in them, so we can sell them for a dollar. There we go. Now we're going to back to our phone, go to shop, and I think they're in the kitchen also. Yep, chairs. So we want the Ica. I'm gonna buy four of those. And we'll wait for him to come. <laughs> there we go. All right, so we can we can carry all these in our inventory magically. This is the exit door, by the way. I think we can just walk up here. Yeah, we can. There we go. Let's let's just place the chair perfectly down. All right, so we have completed all requirements. Good job, you finished all the requirements. You can now go to the laptop or entrance door to finish the contract. Let's see how much money you have earned. All right, so instead we can go in the contract, but go into the contract menu on your laptop. There we go. In job, we're gonna get paid at $2,100. Now I'm not, I thought we got paid $2,100 already let's see what it says yes all right so we did everything correctly except for we didn't use the bios brand that they wanted so 75 percent satisfaction so six requirements met zero not met one preferences met we got a bonus and we spent money from the contract Spent for personal, total 2,088. So I guess it's the total that we're getting. Cause, so it does subtract, I guess, what we bought. Customize your home. Now you've completed your first contract and earned some money. That's great. You can customize your apartment if you'd like to. Simply select the furnitures you desire from the shop. Customize the looks, feel, custom place in your home. Okay. That's the end of the tutorial. Wishlist the game. Thank you for playing through the tutorial level. Please, please take a minute and add Handyman Corporation to your Steam wish. Steam wish list. I've already done that. Looks like your clients are as pleased of you as I am. Well, that was nice of her to say. Um, okay, she's still sitting there, not making any money for us. But okay, so now I guess doors destroyed. All right, so I, can, so I can work on my apartment now. That's cool. Uh, let's see if we have any more contracts in this prologue. Contracts. We do. Looks like we have one more contract. Fix, replace TV stand. Um, okay, so anyway, that's about the gist of the game. Uh, I like that they actually have a couple more contracts you can do. And you can decorate your apartment. So, uh, I... We did... Look, this fridge is destroyed. Okay. Um, how much is a new fridge? Sell it. I wonder how much a new fridge is to buy. Uh, kitchen, fridge, the BIOS is 900, the Danby is 220. Oh, the BIOS is the tall one, I think. Configure. Um, oh, we have options. Oh, no, that's cool. You got different colors. Glossy. Ooh, look at that. Uh, let's just go with the regular. Color instead of texture. All right, that's pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and buy a new fridge for the wife. Now, I wonder where I get my... Oh, I just <laughs> put it right here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, it just plopped it right there. All right, let's see. Well, just let me place it there. All 
There we go. All right, honey, I bought you a brand new refrigerator. You should be really happy with this one. Yeah. All right, cool. So, hey guys, I, I like this. Um, I, I think it looks pretty good for for prologue. They'll definitely do some work on it. Uh, but I like the little mini games. I think they're fun. So, uh, hey, you know, I just want to show you what this looks like. If you like it, you can go ahead and add it to your wish list. And if you like this video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I do appreciate each and every one of you that subscribes. And come back and see me for more episodes and demos like this. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.